kidney stones are super painful. And although they're super painful, they may be a wake-up call to change your lifestyle. Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Sarah Alfeki. I'm board certified in internal medicine, and you have to listen to the entire video if you never wanna have a kidney stone again. These seven lifestyle recommendations will help decrease your risk of a future kidney stone. Number one, you should ask your doctor for a 24-hour urine collection. This will give you very important data which will help us tailor a treatment plan for you. It can give us the, the pH of your urine, it will give us the calcium content of your urine, the uric acid, the oxalate, the citrate content of your urine, and we can make really great recommendations and tailor recommendations and medications or lifestyle changes for you. The second thing is to drink eight to 12 cups of water. Better yet, everybody knows to drink more water, but, the, but what everybody doesn't know is if you add fresh lemon juice to the gallon pitcher of water and drink it throughout the day, the lemon juice has citrate, which binds the calcium and decreases the risk of formation of calcium stones. So the secret tip is to add freshly squeezed lemon juice. Do not get lemonade that has sugar in it. That will increase your risk of a kidney stone. The third thing you want to do is to decrease, decrease sodium content. Decreasing your sodium, your sodium content less than 2,000 milligrams per day, ideally less than 1,500 milligrams per day. The fourth thing you want to do is to decrease animal-based protein. The meat, chicken, uh, and, and uh, any kind of animal-based protein like steak or red meat or poultry or cheese um, increases the uric acid. Uric acid also increases the acidity of your urine and the increasing the acidity of your urine will cause the formation of kidney stones. So if you want to avoid taking allopurinol, which is a gout-reducing medication, it decreases your uric acid, a lifestyle modification would be to decrease the meat, chicken, and dairy. And then the fourth thing, is to increase fruits and vegetables, beans and lentils. Beans and lentils are plant-based protein, which are great for kidney health, but also help alkalize the urine or make the urine more basic and help you dissolve stones better. It helps decrease the risk of stone formation. Another thing that would really help with kidney stone formation is taking magnesium supplements. 400 milligrams of magnesium glycinate will help decrease the risk of kidney stone formation. And the last but not least, if you have oxalate stones, be careful with the amount of spinach and eggplant that you take. I would only take a cup or two of spinach a day. I wouldn't tell my patient to absolutely stop spinach or absolutely stop eggplant. And last but not least, this is the real last recommendation, is to not drink soda because soda acidifies the urine. Also avoid caffeine, avoid any dark beverages like uh, chocolate milk or chocolate or, or tea, or black tea or black coffee. If you want one-on-one -on -one time with me, go to healingwithmemd.com or sarahelfikimd.com and I can help you with management of diabetes, blood pressure, or weight loss. Cheers, everybody. Have a great day.